All right, so we got Disney Channel animation shows tier list. All right, so we're starting off with DuckTales. DuckTales is a classic. But is DuckTales a goat? I'm going to put DuckTales under A. I'm not going to say DuckTales is goat status, bro, because goat status, there's a couple on here that I already know that I'm going to put goat status. Um, so we're going to see. Quack Attack. It looks familiar, but I can't remember it. So I'm going to put it never. I don't want to disrespect it because it looks real familiar. Like I probably watched it, but I don't want to put it C or D and be people like, oh, you know what you're talking about. It's great. So I'm going to put it there. Goof Troop, classic, bro. Goof Troop. Goof Troop. Da -da 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 -da. Yeah. Like Goof Troop was my show. I used to love Goof Troop, bro. I remember I even had the, the VHS tape of Goof Troop. I used to watch Goof Troop all day. The time, bro. Bonkers was a B. Bonkers was cool. It was it was a cool show to watch as a kid. That if it's on, you was never going to TV to watch Bonkers. Bonkers was a show that it was on and you watched it. I wasn't trying to sit there and record Bonkers or nothing. Dark Queen Duck clap. Remember, this is my list. This ain't nobody else's list. So don't get at me. For putting stuff that you think shouldn't be gold. Dark Queen Duck. Bro. Let's get dangerous. Like Dark Queen Duck was that show. D who are you gonna call? When are you in trouble? DW or however it goes. Dark Queen Duck. Let's get dangerous. Dark Queen Duck. Bro, don't get me started, bro. I have no idea what this is. Marsupials or something? I don't know. Never heard of that. Aladdin is an A. I, I, I don't think... Uh, I, I don't know. Aladdin might be GOAT status. Aladdin animated series. Because back then, you got to think in the 90s, whenever the movies came out, like that Little Mermaid and all that. Even Lion King had on uh, Timon and Pumbaa show. Um, they were all good. They were just like the movies. I, I watched Aladdin. I watched Little Mermaid. All that. I'm gonna put this under A for now. This might go out to GOAT. I just got I just don't wanna I don't wanna put everything under GOAT. Cause a lot of this is nostalgia and I might be tripping just because it's nostalgia. Gargoyles! Bro, I had I had the VHS. I show how old I am. The VHS game where you put the tape in, right? A, a, you actually had a board game to follow with the show. It, it, it was dope, bro. Then, like, they'll have you pause it at certain times to do certain moves and everything. Gargoyles was great. You had Hudson, Brooklyn, Goliath. Uh, I can't think of the other one's names. Bro, I'll tell you, bro. Gargoyles, they need to remake that show. I'm going to put that under A. I'm going to put it under A because I don't know. Because Gargoyles is on Disney Plus and I did watch it. That's what I want to go off of to make it. For it to be an A, I mean a GOAT, it has to be something that I want to watch continuously on Disney+. Plus. That's how I'm really going to know if it's GOAT status. I watched Gargoyles on Disney+, Plus, but it, was, it wasn't it was something where I, I wanted to binge watch it. Goof Troop, I binge watch to this day. Dark Queen Duck, I do the same. Tailspin, GOAT status. Bro, Kit and all them, bro. Baloo. It's crazy how you have Baloo and... Um, Jungle Book and Tailspin, like two different times, like that. They they weren't that creative. Disney wasn't that creative where we could make we can't make two different type of bears. If we're gonna make a bear, it has to be the same one for every story. Like that was kind of trash to me, but Tailspin was that show. I love Tailspin. Kim Possible. Is Kim Possible go? You know what? I never looked like Kim Possible was my show too as a kid. But since having Disney Plus, I never looked up Kim Possible. So how could it be a GOAT to me if I didn't try to look at it on Disney Plus? Because once Disney Plus first came out, I was like a little kid in the candy store. I was just searching up everything. And I don't think Kim Possible is one of them. Legend of Tarzan's a B. I don't think it was that good. I never, I never really seen the movie either. I never really like cared to even. Do people even like Tarzan like that? 
Timon and Pumba? Don't at me, bro. Don't at me. Like, Timon and Pumba. Timon and... I forgot. I, I've been trying to figure out how, how the actual things went. Timon and Pumba was that. Yeah. I love Timon and Pumba. Quack Pack. Sounds real familiar. But I don't know if I've seen it. New Adventures of Winnie the Pooh. A. That, that was good. I love Winnie the Pooh, bro. No, don't don't laugh at me, bro. When I was I'm talking. I was a little kid though. I was like four or five watching Winnie the Pooh. I wasn't ten, like these shows. I'll be like ten years old watching these shows. All these shows. The Adventures of Winnie the Pooh, bro. That's like I'm four or five. I still need my little blankie. I'm sucking on my thumb watching it. I'm not watching that as a ten year old. Lilo and Stitch, bro. I told you they have a trend. Like every movie came out, they would end up having a show for it. And the shows sometimes were better than the movies. Like I watched that show more than I watched the Lilo Stitch movie. 629, what are you doing? Well, you know, Adventures of Gummy Bears were okay. I remember watching it, but I was like, eh. Mighty Ducks is one of the shows that I went back on Disney Plus to watch. And it did not age well. I watched like one episode. So. Nostalgia wants me to put it on A. But I'm going to go ahead and put it on B. Nostalgia does want me to put it. Because I did love. I love that show. I was infatuated with it. Bro. I wanted, I wanted to play hockey. But here in Florida. We don't have rings bro. And my mom could not afford. To. Um, you know. For me to do. So we used to do. We used to play street hockey as a kid. Bro, we but we didn't have like actual hockey pucks. We just had balls, like balls. Um, we either have like baseballs, or I think they had like a plastic type of ball. Hey, Irene, appreciate Viper, appreciate the follow. That's love. Um, yeah, so we would have ball, and we'll we'll like, oh, if you hit it in a certain spot. Of course, we didn't have nets or nothing either. And, but yeah. 101 Dalmatian show was good. I can't really, really remember it. So I don't even know if I really watched it. I don't think I'm having anything like in C or D class, to be honest with you. Recess, bro. Goat status. Recess might be number one. Recess was that show. TJ and all them. Bro, that was that show. Bro, I'm getting. Oh my God. The nostalgia, bro, just thinking about, bro, I'm just getting excited about this. This might be my favorite tier list I ever made. I don't know why they make this bigger for y'all. I'm tripping. Um, Pepper Ann, bro, I used to like Pepper Ann, too. Pepper Ann was dope. Marvel Spider-Man. Now, which one is this one? This isn't the one in 94. Put it B. I was never see like I don't understand why that's on here, cause in that case they would have X Men on here, right? Cause X Men and Batman anime series are the greatest two cartoon shows from the nineties. Emperor's New School, Emperor's New Groove, classic, a very Emperor's New Groove is an underrated Disney movie of all time, very underrated. Nobody talks about it, bro. But we're going to put that in A also. Hercules was good. See, to me, Hercules and Tarzan are complete opposites. I don't think no one really cared about Tarzan, but everyone loved Hercules. And they're pretty much the same character, which you, if you really think about it. Mickey Mouse Works was good. I remember that show. Ch -ch Chippendale, Rescue Ranger, Ch -ch Chippendale, na 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 na. Bro, Chip and Dale is a goat, bro. I don't care what you say. Chip and Dale, goat status, bro. Facts. The Weekenders. I want to say I know this, but I don't. I, it doesn't ring a bell. Little Mermaid was dope. I'm not going to put it goat status, but it was dope. But I, If y'all haven't seen my reaction, go ahead and, and, and look it up on YouTube, bro. I'm, I'm ready for that movie. I want to see how they're going to do that movie. A lot of people are mad about the movie. 
I'm not going to get into that, but Little Mermaid show might be better than the movie. That might be one of the times that it's better than the movie. Teacher's Pet was cool. It was all right. Why do they have these Spider-Mans up here, though? That's what I don't understand. Can't go wrong with Spider-Man. The replacement was fun. I like that show. Buzz Lightyear, Star Commander. It was cool. I, I, I watched that show a little bit. Phoenix and Ferb. I'm putting out a B. I didn't like it. A lot of people like Phoenix. I was about to sit there in front, but no, I got to keep y'all. I got to keep it a bean with y'all, bro. I did not like Phoenix and Ferb. I thought it was, I don't know. I, I, I just didn't. Phoenix and Ferb, I don't know. A lot of people love Phoenix and Ferb. I just didn't like it. DuckTales, bro. Well, I felt like I already did DuckTales. That's GOAT status, right? DuckTales got to be GOAT status. Lloyd in Space was pretty funny. I remember that. The Proud Fat, bro. Proud Family's GOAT status, too. I got a lot of GOAT statuses, but Proud Family is something that I still watch today on Disney+. Plus. And all these other shows, I have no idea. So I'm not even going to react to none of that. But this is my list. This is my list. Take it how you want. Let me know where I was wrong. And let me know, like, what's the number one GOAT show from this list? Let me know in the comments. I think Recess, out of all these, Recess is probably the greatest show on this list. I could be wrong. Some people might be like, no, it's not, bro. I don't care. Assuming. 